If we get Kershaw 09 again, I do not know what to think. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. 2018 Fireballs here, back with another MLB 9 Innings 24 video. We're here with the Dodgers team today, guys, and we have yet another Team Slick Sig player pack and a great increase to do. In fact, we'll actually be doing two great increases today, and depending on who we get from the Team Slick Sig player pack, it may end up being Jim Wynn or uh, the person from the Team Slick Sig player pack. I'll also be using a normal great increase ticket on a historic player, and I'll let you guys guess who that historic player is until we get to him. But this is what the team's looking like right here we are at 120 overall as you guys can see jim win is in my uh bench right now he is the uh one of the top overall signature cards for the dodgers at a 72 base right here i didn't know he was this good uh, i also have that trey turner 21 sig that i pulled in the last video but we definitely need, definitely need more help in our outfield. I would definitely prefer replacing Chris Taylor right now over my Trey Turner. Uh, Chris Taylor, although he's been in my lineup for a long time, he is not really performing that well. And Bellinger here, eventually I want to replace him, but he's doing pretty well with his legend skill set. So that's the lineup for the batters right there. For the pitchers, as always, I have all my SIGs and legends in my starting rotation. I wouldn't mind a bullpen SIG, uh, especially a good Kenley Jansen. That'd be really, really nice, but I don't think I would grade increase him over Jim win at the current moment let's see what we have here we have one team sig player pack one regular sig player pack uh, we'll be saving all the other special packs like i said in my last video we'll be saving them for a live stream in, in the near future hopefully and without further ado let's just get started right here with silver player packs currently i am special training my Esmani grandal catcher card and honestly i've kind of run out of guys to special train so i'm hoping with this new uh grade increase and new signature card that we'll get uh, to diamond that we'll use our special training material on him instead and with the team select sig player pack i would really 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 prefer to get a, a batter uh, mookie betts cody bellinger uh, freddie freeman shohei otani or actually otani doesn't have a sig yet but he will be getting a sig and i know some people have been saving their signature player packs just in case or most likely shohei otani is getting a sig so they're, they're saving their sig player packs basically to try and get a 2024 Shohei Otani SIG, which I don't blame them for, but me, I wait a long time to open up these packs, so it's like when I get the opportunity to, I'm not really going to wait. We get a vintage right there. That is like our fourth vintage in the past like three videos, so we've been seeing a lot of vintage cards, and let's see, do we have any more space? We don't, so let's do some special training. All right, let's do 30 more premium player packs here. Also guys, special shout out to ABT, Frankie Superdude, and Jfish for being members of this channel. I do really appreciate their support, and if you guys haven't, go ahead and check out their channels. They make great content there. Uh, I know you guys would enjoy their content, and they make um, pretty uh, cool MLB 9 Innings videos and other content related to it too. So go ahead and check them out, and I just wanted to give them a shout out to show appreciation for their support of this channel. All right, last set of 10 right here. We didn't get any diamonds, so I'm hoping that means we get good luck. We've duped a couple of times in the past few videos, so I'm hoping that we don't dupe a team sig here in this video um, but with the dodgers honestly this has the i have the highest chance of duping simply because clayton kershaw has so many team sig years and uh, i could club craft if i do end up pulling a kershaw um, that i don't need arguably i'd use the best year kershaw in place of the 2009 kershaw which is his worst year uh, in my lineup right now but uh it'd be a really tough decision all right it's full again let's do special training All right, ultimate player packs here. We have nine of them. Let's see how many diamonds. And I'm guessing we get two. <laughs> Guys, I am almost flawless with this. Let's go. Two diamonds. Can any of them be a Dodger? Uh, nope, we get a Dansby Swanson. Atlanta Brave right there, 70 base overall. And then a JP Fireisen, 2021. Fireisen was really good, but I don't know what he's doing now. I remember he was pretty hyped up in Tampa, but he uh, I don't think he fell off the face of the earth. I think he just phased out sort of kind of anyway team select ultimates we don't get any diamonds out of these all right that's okay let's see what we get though we have um muncie chris martin from 22 and dustin may i i don't know why dustin may just can never seem to stay healthy i think he has a signature card but i could be wrong 
and, and anything guys i really don't want to get a starting pitcher sig unless it's best year kershaw because my rotation is full and unless it's better than bob feller first set uh diamond player selectives right here no dodgers out of the first uh draw second draw there's a greg is on blue jays catcher's card that i would love on my blue jays team we do get a michael kopech from this past year I actually already have this card since I pulled him from a live uh, team select diamond pack earlier in the year, but we'll take him anyway. Let's do four more of these diamond player selective packs. We have so many from league mode and stage challenge and the like, so uh, diamond player selective packs are pretty common nowadays. All right, second set here, nothing really outstanding. Honestly, pretty terrible stuff. Uh, I'll just take Nate, Nate Pearson here because Nate Pearson. All right. Three more. Let's go. Come on. Prime Vintage. I would love a Prime. Preferably a Prime. I have not seen a Prime out of any of these packs in forever. Judge 23. Good card. Good power hitter. Uh, Skeens 24. That is a card I forgot to take on my Wish Player pack in my last Pirates video. I'll take him here uh, since he is the best overall card. But yeah, Paul Skeens had an insane rookie season, started the All-Star game, as you guys know. And uh, I won't forget to get him in my next Pirates video, which should be coming up pretty shortly. All right, nothing special here besides Nolan Arenado. Um, let's refresh again. Come on. We only have two more. Yet again, no special cards. There's a Richie Sexton, pretty good card right there. Jock Peterson from the year the Braves won the World Series. AJ Brzezinski for the Chicago White Sox, but... Come on, I, I, I want to see a Prime. Where are the Primes? I hope this means we get really lucky and pull a Team Sig card. All right, last one right here. No Prime out of the first draw. All right, second time, we get nothing. All right, we got Jason Hayward from 23. Although it's not a good card, it is a Dodger, so I guess we'll take that. All right, we have now Team Select Diamond Player Packs. Let us do all of them. Uh, the Dodgers have only Pitcher Legends and Roy Campanella. And we don't get a legend anyway. I still really wish they would add Jackie Robinson back into the game. Don't know why he's gone, but for some reason he is. All right. Uh, nothing really good here. Uh, Brad Penny is decent, but there are a lot of better starting pitchers, including Alex Wood as well. Uh, Trinan 24, actually pretty similar to his 23. I think oh, it's not 23. He's 21, but I did get his 21 in the last, last Dodgers video. So I'm not going to be using the 24. All right, pitcher batter pack. Let's go batter just because I'd love to get Roy Campanella. And uh, I don't think I would use a starting pitcher legend if I did end up getting one. All right, first card here, not going to be a legend. Let's see who this is. It is Kike Hernandez. I think I have his 19. I don't remember where I put him, though. He's not in my lineup currently. All right, and then last one, going batter once more. Let's see Campanella here. If we get Campanella, that'd be amazing. All right, never, ever going to happen, I most likely think. This is Max Muncy 22, not his greatest year, um, but every Max Muncy year is at least a decent hitting card. But here we go now with our SIG player packs. We only have two, and if we have to craft, we will craft. First one, just a normal. It is a diamond. Wow, okay. Wish that was the team select. Maybe I should have opened the team select first, unless this is a Dodger, which would be great. I'm not going to do no look strap for this. Let's just flip it open. If this is a Dodger, that'd be epic. It is not. It is a Nationals Vladdy Guerrero, uh, not Junior, Vladdy Guerrero from 2000. Sorry to you Nationals teams. That is a great card for hitters. It's a good DH uh, card. And then now, Team Select Sig Player Pack. Let's go with the right team here. Going Dodgers. Please be a diamond. All right. I should have opened this one first to get the diamond. It is a silver. If we end up getting a starting pitcher or Kershaw, uh, that is not good enough. Uh, I will be club crafting. So let's do this. No look strat again. Three, two, one. <laughs> if we get Kershaw 09 again, I do not know what to think. Wow. <laughs> Wow. I You just can't make this stuff up. Comtu said, "Hey, I've trolled you enough with Kershaw. Well, 
How about Trey Turner now? I mean, granted, it's not the same year, but still, I... Really funny comp to us. Really, really funny. That That's classic. Anyways, because of that, uh, something new happens every time, guys. I, I can kid you not. Like, y y something out of left field just happens like that where you don't expect. I didn't even think about that happening. Anyway, well, let's go to the club store and club craft. That's kind of frustrating, but at least we have craft protection. And uh, hopefully this doesn't give us a Kershaw. And, uh, all right, we got the Kershaw 09, we got the Turner 22, and, yeah, let's, let's hope for not another dupe. Like, Turner only has two years, too, and that was the worst, uh, the worser of the two. All right, last one, we're not even gonna, like, no look strap for this. Diamond? No diamond, all right, gold, maybe? All right, silver again. Let's just hop into it, whatever's whatever, please just don't be Kershaw or Turner. Good, good, good. Okay, I'll take that. That is not his best year. Evan Phillips, 2023. But it is not a dupe, and I'll take that. And a bullpen card, um, not better than Jim Wynn, so we'll save him uh, for a great increase for later on. But oh, thank goodness it was not another Kershaw or a Trey Turner. We have something that we'll throw in. He'll replace the 22, uh, but comparatively, the 22 is uh, much, much better, especially with fastball and break. I'm not going to complain, though. This is a free-to-play team. He'll go in in the future. But now, since we have that new team sig, that is our 1, 2, 3, 4, uh, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9th team sig <clears throat> on this Dodgers team. So super excited about that. And now we are going to officially use our grade increase tickets. Uh, let's first use our grade increase ticket on Jim Wynn. And then we are going to uh, skill change him and try to get him a good skill set. Using great increase ticket on Jim Wynn. He's going to replace Chris Taylor. So super hyped about that. I do have a lot of black diamond pieces as well. So we're going to speed up the video once we get him to black diamond and then start doing premium skill change tickets. Let's use these BD pieces right here. 496 of them in total. A lot of this has come in the most more recent past. Um, I honestly have no idea where they've come from. But most likely events in the new updates. But boom, Jim Wynn is now a black diamond. He will definitely boost our outfield and now let's speed up the video and do some skill changing on him Okay, so we ended up using about 28 premium skill change tickets, and just like the last video, we didn't see much, only saw batter's chemistry. So we have three legend skill change tickets, and I hope these work. Um, let's do them though. I, I hope to not use more than two, but let's start off with the first one here. Please be something good. Hard hitter. One, two, three. I'll take that, I guess. I don't know how good hard hitter is, but I'm gonna open up a second skill slot storage. Because I don't have much faith in that. It's the same exact level skill set that we got in our last video with Control Master. Um, but I'm going to do another one. And hopefully this isn't Batter's Chemistry or Batter's Insight. Let's do it here. Come on. Something like Pioneer. Contact Master. Same level skills. Well, I think I'm going to experiment with that for now. Because I have one more card that I wanted to grade increase. And that card is... Let me just pull him up right here with the normal grade increase ticket. We have Mike Piazza, 1997. So let's normal grade increase. Mike Piazza, he is going to be our new catcher in the near future. And I know I'm currently special training Yasmani Grandal. I just didn't want to sp <clears throat> spoil it for you guys. So here's Mike Piazza. And we're going to use a normal black diamond change ticket on him as well. Uh, just so we don't have to waste black diamond pieces. 
But here we have him, Mike Piazza, going to Diamond, and now Black Diamond. We're also going to skill change him. Um, I'm going to craft some normal uh, premium skill change tickets, and then use them on him. We, as you guys can see, we have 647 skill change tickets, and I, I quite literally have no use for him, or use for them. So let's craft. Um, we can only craft three at a time, so let's craft three of them, and uh, see if we can get anything on him. Of course, we see Batter's Chemistry. Um, that's just a troll again. I won't be using the Legend Skill Change ticket on him, but let me know your guys' thoughts on Jim Wynn. I'm going to just toss him in for Chris Taylor right now since he is a better overall and kind of move him down the lineup here. There we go. All right, so Jim Wynn currently running a, a 13 to the right side train, 13 to power, 13 eye, and 9 to contact. Hard hitter, 5 tool, heavy hitter. I'm not going to use any blues or greens on this yet. I don't know how good hard hitter is, but I may end up just sticking with this for now. I may end up having to change the train. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. And we got Mike Piazza. Where is he? We got him to Black Diamond. We're going to upgrade him uh, off camera, and we will get him a better skill set than this. This actually isn't terrible. Spotlight Laser Beam, not a bad skill set for a catcher for the time being. And also we will eventually get our evan phillips here upgraded i won't be doing it in this video i'll be doing it in a future video but super thankful that we didn't dupe twice that would have just made me infuriated i would have been pretty upset anyway but he's going to replace the regular evan phillips that you guys saw earlier so overall a very satisfying video we will have one more or actually two more team select sig player packs one for my red sox team and one for my pirates team coming in the future but until then that's going to be it for me today if you guys haven't already go ahead and check the description box down below for other mlb nine innings youtubers that make great mlb nine innings content i know they would appreciate your guys support i know you guys would enjoy their content also feel free to check out the description box for my social media links i have links to reddit instagram Instagram and discord feel free to join those if you would like to and with all that said and done that's going to be it for me today have a great rest of your guys day god bless you all jesus loves you guys i'll see you in the next video